Pork steak is one of the leanest and most tenderest cuts of pork you can cook with. I love it. I'm gonna show you a very quick marinade. We have some chili, which we just peeled. I also have some fennel seed, which I've toasted in a dry pan. Smoked paprika, now I love this, and this works really well in the sauce, but also in the marinade. Garlic and some ground cumin. I'm gonna just mix it with a little bit of olive oil, or you can use some Irish rapeseed oil. And then I'm gonna place the juice of a lemon in here, and then just squeeze all this in here. And then you give it a stir here. I'm gonna put the pork into this. And if you can leave this for a few hours, like any marinade, or overnight in your fridge. Cover it in cling film, because you don't want your whole fridge smelling of garlic and all these lovely spices. And just simply turn that every so often. So you leave that, if you can, as long, definitely for about three or four hours. And then you have a beautiful piece of pork like this. Kind of changes the color a little bit because of the lemon juice. What I'm gonna do is make the pepper sauce. Heat the pan, a little bit of oil. So first thing I'm gonna do is put in the garlic. And then in goes the onion and the chili. So the peppers are raw, but we're gonna cook them out in the pan. So there's gonna be lots of sweetness and color and flavor, just a pinch of sugar. And then I'm gonna put in some more of the smoked paprika. So I'm gonna give this about 10 minutes until it's lightly kind of softened and a little bit of color, not too much. So after 10 minutes, this is what they look like. They're slightly softened. And I've caught a little bit of colour, and that's the onion, I think, kind of caramelise. I'm going to put some plum tomatoes. Scrape this out. So we're going to bring that back to the boil, and we're going to season it with a bit of salt and pepper. So that's the sauce ready. I'm going to pour it into an oven-proof dish. Just hold it right down close to the pan to the dish, and scrape all this beautiful sauce. So look at the way the pork has changed the colour from the marinade. Make sure the pan is hot. So place it on. It's exactly what you want to hear. I'm just going to lightly seal this just to start to cook the spices. So you get your pork steak lifted off and it goes right into the centre of the dish on top of the peppers. Just scrape in the rest of the marinade, a little bit of water, scrape it all down, switch it off and then you just simply pour this all over the pork. Cover this with some tin foil. And this is going to go into the oven at 180, and this is going to take 30 minutes to cook. So after 30 minutes, the pork should be cooked. Just be careful. Oh yeah, beautiful. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to lift out the pork, I'm going to slice it. Now before I do that, I'm serving it with some sauteed potatoes. So you par cook your potatoes, cut them in half, and then just cook them in a little bit of butter. I'm just going to finish them with some chopped parsley. So it's a lovely accompaniment. Then we're going to slice the pork fillet. So I'm going to slice it at an angle, just using the tongs just to help you. Or you can use a carving fork. I'm going to put the pork, then just simply fan it out, sit it on top of the peppers, and another little piece there. And I think that is a beautiful way of serving one of my favorite cuts. That's the quality assured pork steak with a red pepper sauce. And remember, Always choose food with the Board Bia quality mark so that you know where your food comes from and that has been produced to the highest Board Bia quality standards.